All right, folks, we're back. Um, I got a new light mounted. I'll show you that you guys that another time. I'm pretty happy with it actually. Just got it plugged in just like this. I got that light on this switch. Not bad. Meh. Better. Yeah, I like it that way. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Still got that cough. So, where were we? Oh, uh, we were talking about this reel. Well, this is the, the Zebco 270 Brute that I showed you that, I, that we scattered a minute ago. That is the term, scattered. When you have a reel scattered or a piece of equipment scattered, it means you have it taken apart in a logical order. Okay, first piece off, second piece off, yada, yada, yada. Okay. It's important that when scattering, you really do, you have something appropriate for the scatter. So this is a small fishing reel. Um, I've got a white surface here. So I can put down screws, I can find screws. Um, it, it, it helps me identify everything really quick and easy. Now, if I needed more room, if I was doing, say, a, I don't know, scattering a, a nail gun or a compressor or a carburetor or whatever, I would have a bigger, more appropriate size work safe surface, excuse me. I'd do something like that on a, a two by two board over sawhorses, you know, with some old drop cloth. That'd be appropriate. But for something this size, this works out great. So continuing on, we're gonna back these two screws off. I think this reel is gonna come apart, but I really don't know. So let's just back these screws out. There's one, there's two. And something's loose for sure. This, this is semi-loose. This is loose, but See, it's not going to do anything for you. All it does is just hold that mechanism in place. This other little screw, I don't know if you can see it, this other little screw right here, that's your drag screw. Okay, so it's backed all the way off. Let's see if that loosens up anything. No, it doesn't loosen up anything. The button doesn't loosen up anything. On most of the Zebcos, like the 33s, um, <coughs> the 200s are a solid body on the, the back end, but uh, the later versions of the 33s, this would twist and drop down to give you access to your, your actual spool, your um, gear, and your shaft, okay? Um, this reel, it looks to be pinned in right through there, and I need some more light. Let's see if this guy is in there. I can't, I can't see down in there. See, I got nothing. I got nothing in there. I'm gonna see if I get a flashlight. 